what's going on people today is sunday uh what is it june 27th and this is my bt awards pre-show because i'm gonna tell y'all who i think should win awards and we gonna see if i was right if i'm psychic and whatnot we've all heard the hoopla surrounded around the awards are uh, this year you know the michael jackson tribute but we already knew they was gonna have to do a michael jackson tribute because of that crap they pulled off last year um Giant said that they're going to do Chris Brown. I don't think it's that much of a stretch. I don't doubt it. I wish Chris had a little backbone about him to tell them, F you, because y'all played me last year when I was in town and could have did it. You know what I mean? Dang, the boy repented and did all of that for his little smacking up Rihanna. Like, come on, can this brother live and work? But anyway, y'all stay tuned for that. On to the awards. And you know, these uh, awards were determined by me, Kim. <laughs> so, the first artist is, oh, no, 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 the first award was the best female R&B. Hmm. They got Alicia Keys, Melanie Fiona, Mary J. Blige, Rihanna, and Beyonce. All right. I'm going to rock with Alicia Keys on this one just for GP. I don't know. I mean, if they give Beyonce another award, I'll probably jump through the damn screen because this year, you know, whatever. And, um, honestly... In all actuality, I think Melanie Fiona probably produced the best album out of these people this year. But you know, that's just me. So we rocking with eight keys. So expect her and her belly up on stage accepting that award. Um, Lashonda will probably have a fit. But <laughs> okay, on to the next one. The best male R&B award. I'm going to rock with Maxwell just for GP. You know how they decide these winners. Like, come on. He's up against Chris Brown. He's never going to get an award. He's lucky if they let him in the building. Like, take your Michael Jackson tribute and run with that homie and try again next year. Trey Songs, good, but nah, I don't think it, he's award worthy just yet. Usher, nah, I actually like the new album, but I don't see him getting an award. In all actuality, I love Raheem Devon. He should get the award, but he's not going to get it. So I'm going to go with Maxwell just for the hype and the hoopla of him coming back. Not that some of his songs wasn't hot because I like it, but you know, Maxwell. Next up, Best Female Hip Hop. And I'm kind of questioning the nominees. They got Nikki. We expected her. They got Trina. Mm. They got Little Kim. Like... Did she drop something that I don't know about within the last year? Or, or And then they even got Missy Elliott. Like, no, no, not Missy. I'm sorry. They got Esther Dean who looks like Missy Elliott in her picture. However, Esther Dean ain't a rapper. So I don't get that classification. And um, they got Rashida from, you know, ATL, Georgia Peach in the house. Um, I'm going to say they're going to give it to Dog on Nikki. I really ain't feeling nobody in that category as uh, hip-hop worthy. I guess Nicki should get it for just buzz alone. You know, you can't hate on her. She has fish grease right now. But uh, I ain't too looking forward to that category because uh, the nominees just, is just picking seem to be rather slim to me. Um, the Best Male Hip-Hop Awards, you got Drake up against Jay-Z, Luda, B.O.B., and Fab. In all actuality, I would have to say that uh, Jay-Z, come on. I don't think he should be in this running. I would, I would like to see Luda walk away with this award because pound for pound, style for style, album for album, you can't front on Luda. My boy got, uh, he got flows, he got lyrics. Like, I like Luda. But, um, I wouldn't be surprised if they gave it to Drake just because of the hoopla. Uh, best collab. They got Beyonce and Gaga with that video phone crap. Eh. They got our Drake, Wayne, and Eminem. Eh. They got Drake and Trey Songz. Eh. Jay-Z and Alicia Keys. In New York. That's going to win. We already know. Um, they got Trey and Fab and B.O.B. and Mars. Y'all already know what's going to win. Concrete jungle where dreams are made of. Okay, let me stop. Now, <laughs> the best new artist. They got Justin Bieber. Huh? What you talking about, Willis? Justin Bieber? Is this not the Black Entertainment Awards? But anyway, Justin Bieber, Nicki Minaj, Young Money. Is Young Money an artist? Hell, that's a whole crew, a posse. They a squad, a gang. They ain't no artist. Artist, single. Artist, singular. But anyway, Young Money, Melanie, Fiona, and Wale. 
that new Wale junk is hot. But uh, that diary. Da, na, 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 na. Look, anyway, I'm rooting for Melanie Fiona because her CD was hot. I'm telling y'all, if y'all ain't got it, Melanie Fiona is the way to go. But um, I wouldn't be surprised if they ride the Young Money train. But um, thumbs up for Melanie Fiona. Best group, New Boys. Don't know them. Young Money again. Okay, this category is fitting. Black Eyed Peas, I got that boom boom pow. You chickens jockin' my style. I'm on that next. No, no, let me stop. And uh, Dirty Money and Diddy. And the clips. Huh. Clips, it ain't gonna happen for you. Diddy. Eh, 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 eh. Take that, take that, take that. Nope. Um, Black Eyed Peas had a phenomenal year. If they don't win, this category is rigged because they should win. I don't know what's going on with Will I Am and Fergie, and we're gonna check out the body language on the show. But I'm rocking for them. The best video they got run this town. Till it coming in the air. <laughs> okay. Them and their little let y'all tell it devil worship and Masonic video. I liked it. It was kind of hot. Kind of Mad Max looking to me. But you know, I liked it. Uh, they got the video phone with Gaga and Beyonce. <clears throat> um, Empire State again. Uh, Melanie. And it kills me. Uh, to know how much I really love you. Uh, if I hear what I, ooh, ooh, ooh. All right, I love that song, but I'm gonna have to go with strictly video. I had to say Run This Town because it was hot. The Young Stars Award. They got Selena Gomez. Never heard of her. Kiki Palmer. I'm riding for Kiki. Uh, they got Tyler Williams. That's the little boy. Hate Chris or something. Willow Smith. What has she done to be up for this award? Did I miss something that dropped? And uh, Lil JJ. I'm going to ride with Kiki Palmer just because I like her. Best Actress. Taraji. Monique. Zoe. Saldana. Gabby. Sidibe. Whatever. And Regina King. We know Monique going to take that. But I would like to see Gabby win it. You know. I ain't mad at that. Best Actor. They got Quentin somebody. Jamie Foxx, Denzel, Idris Elba, and Don Cheadle. We already know. Denzel done got enough awards. Yo, I would love to see Don Cheadle win because I just love Mouse. Do y'all remember that movie, Devil in the Blue Trap? If you ain't want them shot, what you living with me for? All right, I'm going for him. Best gospel, I'm just going Marvin Sapp off the top because I haven't really listened to any gospel music this year, so I don't know. Centric Award. Again, I don't even know what that award is about, but I'm going to say Chrisette Michelle because I dig her a lot. So I'm rocking for her. Sports Woman of the Year, come on. There's only one. I'm going with Serena. She should win. Um, let's see. Sportsman of the Year. I'm just going with Kobe because that's what they're going to do anyway. You got LeBron and the rest of them in the running, but come on. They really going to pick Kobe. We already know what it is. So this is my take on the BET Awards. We're going to see what happens for real when y'all watch live. And um, y'all stay tuned to the show. And we're going to chop it up and talk about stuff later. And um, I ain't going to say too much bad. Because y'all have y'all noticed that I, I, I'm, I'm veering away from the gossip. I want some other content. But uh, I'm about to get out here because I got some stuff to do. So there it is. Your Shut Up BET Awards pre-show. I get back with y'all.